<clears throat> Good evening, people. Good evening. Good evening, teacher. Hello. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Hello, good evening. I am driving on my home. Okay, be careful. Okay, welcome everyone. It is time to get started. Eight o'clock sharp. So let's get started this evening, okay? Well, okay, let me start introducing myself. My name is Saul Montoya. I will be your facilitator in this module. Uh, it's a pleasure to meet you. I am uh, Engl an English teacher. I've been an English teacher for oh, almost 25 years, a little bit more maybe, teaching children, teenagers, young adults, adults, teaching um, technical careers, uh, a lot of practice. Um, I have worked in different private institutions. I never liked, wanted to work with a public school. Um, so, and during the pandemic, especially during the quarantine, I took my chance to work in a call center from home. Um, I didn't like it too much. Being honest, I'm too I'm too old for that. That's the reason. The job is good, okay, but I'm too old for that. Even though the first account where I started the practice is it was nice. I used to work from 4 p.m. to 1 a.m. in the morning. And that was fine for me because I am a night person. So I stay late at night, so that wasn't any problem for me. The account was easy, was nice. But then they closed that account and they moved me to another account. That the account wasn't that bad. The second one, it was with Grubhub. It's just uh, like a delivery um, account for food, for like Google. Uh, I work, but we work not for the customers. We work for the restaurant. We help the restaurants with their menus, with um, um, orders, uh, it was good, but the people in El Salvador was there. I didn't like them, so I quit. And I worked uh, almost for six or nine months as an interpreter, always online. That was a good experience. I started interpreting for different companies like insurance companies, uh, electricity companies, banks, banks, uh, 
credit cards, uh, what else? Some services or utilities like uh, water services, gas services, uh, cable companies, internet uh, companies. So uh, it was interesting. Later, they moved me to work as a um, medical interpreter. It was really interesting too, interpreting for people with the doctors in the hospitals, in clinics, uh, different places. It was a good experience. I had to interpret for a lady who was in labor. I mean, she was giving birth baby. And I was in the middle interpreting. Uh, that was nice. But they pay too low. They pay too low. So when classes get uh, got better, so I returned to my to my favorite practice. This is my favorite. So that's a little bit about me. Uh, I live in Lourdes. I am married with four children, all of them are adults already. I have one granddaughter, and well, that's me. I like to hear a little bit about you. Okay, so I want you to introduce yourself. Give me your name. Give me your uh, where. Tell me where you live, what you do, your occupation, your favorite things or your hobby. Yeah, tell me a little bit about you. I want to know you. But please, people, also turn on your camera. You must have your cameras on here. Okay. So who wants to start? Who wants to volunteer to start introducing him or herself. Me, teacher. Okay, Elizabeth. Go ahead, please. Okay. Good evening, teacher, classmate. I I happy uh, to learn English with in in support in support. Uh, I am este, I am a teacher. Oh, good. Uh, colleague. Yes. Uh, I I work I work in public security, <laughs> and I am supervision the person. Mm -hmm. And I live in Sonsonate. Okay. Uh, only. But you're a teacher? Yes. You're a teacher and you work as a supervisor in a security company? Yes. Oh, interesting. Yes, I am. Okay. Okay, Elizabeth. And you live in Sonsonate? Yes. It's oh. very hot. Very hot. Yeah, I know. Sonsonate is really hot. Okay, Elizabeth, thank you very much. Do me a favor. Could you please raise your virtual hand? Uh, let me show you which one. Raise your hand, this, this hand. So to, in that way, I will know that you already participated, okay? Okay, who's next? Can I teach you? Sure. But can you turn on your camera to know you? Right now, maybe. <laughs> okay, Hi. no problem. Ah, yeah, there well, you are. First, I'm grateful and I'm happy to be here again because I have been waiting for a long time, finally. And, and about me, I'm Jancy Andrea Marens Mayen. I'm 17 years old and I love English, my favorite hobby is speaking English <laughs> and all of that. And where you live? Where you live, Jensen? 
Where do you live? Nancy. Where do you live, Jancy? Teacher, excuse me. No tenía el, el audio, solo podía hablar. Okay. Uh, well, I'm living in Zacateco, Luca, La Paz. Oh, I love Ichan Michan in Zacateco, Luca. I love that place. I used to go there very often with my family when I was a child. Long, long time ago. Okay, thank you. Hey, but please uh, raise your virtual hand, Elizabeth and Jancy. Raise your virtual hand, please, to let me know that you are done. Okay. Okay, Julio Cesar, go ahead. Thank you. Uh, good evening, everybody. Uh, my name is Julio Cesar. I live in Santa Tecla. I am 30 years old. I am an electrician. I work at the airport. Only does. Okay, very good, Julio. Welcome. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Thank you very much. Okay, maybe Maybe it's correct, the pronunciation for you? Yeah, yeah okay. it's, it's correct in English. <laughs> okay. Okay, but maybe. In Spanish, call me Mavi, okay. Mavi, okay. Yeah, um, well, um, Mavi, my name is Gladys Mavi Araujo. I'm 54 years old. I have two children, and both of them are living outside of the country. And I'm single, by the way, and I worked for a bank during 20 years, 28 years, 28 years. And now I'm working um, as a beauty consultant for Mary Kay products. And I live in San Jacinto. Okay. Very good, maybe. Nice to meet you. Nice to I, I used to visit San Jacinto a lot in the 80s. I I grew up in Santa Anita. Oh, really? It's yeah. near here. Near, yeah. near San Jacinto. Okay. So let's continue with Jancy. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. My name is Jancy Saray Sanchez Morales. I am 22 years old. I am an international marketing student. I live in San Salvador. I like to read, uh, watch Korean novels and anime. Okay, very good. Thank you, Jancy. Thank you very much. Please, uh, Julio, keep your hand up. So I will know that you already participated. Keep your hand up, Julio. Uh, Morena. Hey, Morena. Ah, your hand was up. Yes. Yeah. Okay, tell us, tell us about you, Morena. Sure. Okay, my name is Morena. I'm pleasure to be here. Nice to see you again, my my. Um, I I don't know, forget it. Um, but my name is classmate. Yes, thank you. Yes, I I working in a call center, and I live near from Ciudad Versalles, and I have a daughter, and I living with my family my my husband my father my mother and i like to be here with you nice to meet you teacher nice to meet you morena very good thank you thank you keep your hand up morena keep your hand up please to okay to show yes me I that do. you already participated okay thank you diego edgardo welcome 
Hello, good evening. And well, uh, my name is Diego Edgardo Vega Herrera. Um, I am so, a software engineer and I work as a DevOps engineer, a high tech consultant. Um, I am 25 years old and I really like to watch uh, anime. Uh, I like to read mangas and play video games. I really like to play video games with my friends. And something else about me, well, I am really curious about English, but I am not really good at English because I am a little bit scared about English, I don't know. <laughs> but when I when I try to talk with a native speaker, it's a little bit scared to me. But yeah, that's it, I think. <laughs> Okay, yes, no problem. That is that is normal. So you should you should make a trip to United States or Canada to practice. Yeah, have I did been, it, but I don't know. <laughs> I did yeah. it, but my best conversation with a native spe native speaker was when a guy come to me and and tell me, well, he asked me, where is the feeder room? I think. And uh I didn't know. So I said, I don't know, man. And that sounds really cool to me, but that was my best um, conversation with an American guy. Ah, okay, okay. <laughs> Good. Don't worry. Opportunities will come. Okay, people. Who's next? Come on, raise your hand. If you want to be the next one. Everybody has to do it, so... Okay, Natalie, thank you. Go ahead. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, classmate. My name is Natalie Castro. I live in Metapan. I'm a lawyer. I work for Metapan Hall. I work in corporations. I like English, but I don't really like to speak in English. <laughs> I love to listen to English. I understand really well, but it's kind of hard to me to express in English. And I guess that's all. <laughs> uh, no, no problem. That happens. Uh, you know, uh, for me to, to communicate in, uh, how can I say? Of course, I prefer Spanish uh, than English. Uh, this is my tool, work, to live. Yeah. Uh, but it is good to have this tool because we know that you can learn new things that are not in Spanish. Uh, you can have new friends. Um, and your brain is uh, developed when yeah. you speak two languages. So, it's, it's, so that's it is, why I'm here. <laughs> yeah, it is healthy. <laughs> it is healthy. Yeah. Okay, Nathan. Thank you. Uh, okay, who's next? It will be me. Okay. My name is Osvaldo. Uh, I apologize, but I cannot turn on my camera because it is not working. But I will introduce myself. Let me tell you, I'm Osvaldo, I'm 26 years old. Uh, I've, been I've been studying English for a long time, but I know I need to learn more because English is so extensive. And I'm looking to improve in here because of that, I decided to be, to be part of, the, of this class. And I hope I will learn and develop my skills in here. And I hope you guys, I will, well, we are going to meet, meet each other. And that's all. Thank you. Okay, Osvaldo. Thank you very much. Could you please uh, raise your hand to show us that you have already participated, okay? Sure, thank you. Okay, who's next? Don't make me call you. One. Two. Okay, no volunteers on my call. Uh, let's start with the ones with the camera off. 
Marcelo. Hello. Hello. Uh, I have a presentation. Presentation. Ah, tell us about you. Where do you live? What is your occupation? Where you work? Or... Okay. Uh, well, uh, my name is Marcelo Sanchez. I I am 27 years old, and I'm work at HTC. HTC, sorry. Um, uh, I like uh, play video games, and I like to learn uh, about uh, programmers, programs, language, languages, mm -hmm. and only that. Okay, Marcelo. Nice meeting you. Very good. Let's continue with Guadalupe. Could you please raise your hand, uh, virtual hand, Marcelo, to show us that you have already introduced yourself. Okay, Guadalupe. Guadalupe, where are you? Not there. Jaime, Jaime Rodriguez. Hello. Hello. Hello, everybody. Uh, my name is Jaime Alberto Rodriguez. I am working in airports at Copa. I, uh, I, I'm I am 43 years old. I have, I have. Uh, I have a door, uh, child, child, children. I, I have nice to meet you today. I'm uh, sorry, okay. I, I am driving. Okay, oh, no problem. Thank you, Jaime. Very good, thank you. Um, Jamie? Is that correct, Jamie? I am here. Oh, okay, go ahead. Uh, good evening, um, my name is Jamie Rosibel. I am 23 years old. My favorite hobby is watch anime. Um, Listen and listen um, music. Um, I live in Ciudad Arce, in the Department de la Libertad. Mm -hmm. I love it, the cat. Oh. Really, I love it, the cat. Really? Um, I have three cats. Three cats. Three My goodness. Cats. <laughs> okay, Jamie, thank you very much. Welcome. Sandra? Sandra Cruz? Hello, everybody. Hello. My name is Sandra Cruz. I live, I live in Santa Ana. I... I am 36 years old. I work in Fundación Superando Juntos, the, the social worker. I am the mother of the of, of two children. Okay. I love the music. Okay, very good. Thank you very much, Sandra. Okay, what about Floor? Hi, good evening. My name is Flora Vidal Castro Rodriguez. I'm working in a packaging manufacturing company in the 
service customer department. Um, well, with the hobbies that I have is a uh, fishing, a sport fishing. I like to fishing with oh. my family, with my boyfriend, my friends. Um, I really like these classes because I feel that it's a good opportunity to practice English. I I have a high school diploma, but I feel that I need to still pra practice because we, when I go to travel to the United States, I feel that I kind of slow with with the native people. So I really yeah. like to to have this opportunity, right? Okay. So nice to meet you. And nice to meet you, Flor. Okay, very good. Thank you. What about Luis? Luis Madrid. Hello, Luis. I am 34 years old. I live in Hicanos with my wife and I work in a call center as a back office account. And I like to watch TV shows and horror movies. Okay. <laughs> Thank you, Luis. Marina. Hello, everyone. My name is Marina Arevalo. I live in Soyapango. And my free time, I really like to spend time with my family and watch movies or series. Um, I really like to listen to music for improve my English. And now I don't work, but I want to get a job this year. Um, I live with my mom and my brothers. I have two cats and one dog. And <laughs> that is all. English is my favorite language and I really like to um, learn English very well and be bilingual for this year. Okay, perfect. You will do it. No, no worries. Okay, very good. Ernesto. Hello. Hello. Uh, my name is Ernesto Hernandez. I'm 31 years old. And I live in Soyapango, San Salvador. I work in a call center for a travel agency called FlyHub. And I like being part of this class and learn more. That's all. Okay. Okay, Ernesto. Thank you. I need a ticket to Colombia. Hmm. I will ask you later. Okay. Uh, what about Vanessa? Me. Me. Yes, you. Uh, my name is Vanessa. I am 29 years old. I, I am living in Santa Tecla. I am from El Salvador. I live with my mother and my brother. I, I had to cut in, in my free time. In my free time, I, I like to learn English. Uh, I, I I want to learn English because I, I want to, to get a new job. I, I would like to 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 work uh, like, like a, a translator or 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 manager. Okay. Uh, in the future I would like to, to work in in a new York like using the, the English. I, I, I like the English. Perfect. Welcome, Vanessa. Nice to meet you. Okay. Who's missing? Julissa? Did you introduce yourself already or not? No, not yet. Okay. Go ahead. Hello. Good evening. Um, my name is Julissa Guerra. 
I am 27 years old. I have two children and I like to play guitar and play football too. Okay. Thank you, Julissa. Uh, who's missing? Chrisia. Hi, good evening. Uh, my name is Chrisia Castillo. I live in Mexican, San Salvador. I am 31 years old. I have a daughter. I'm working in a call center for a travel agency. Um, I like to spend time with my family, my, my daughter and my, my husband. Okay. Another agent for a ticket to Colombia. <laughs> send me. <laughs> send me the estimate, please. Okay. Uh, Alexander. Alexander. Not there. And then we have Jam Jamie Lopez. Not there. Okay. Okay, people. Nice meeting you. So it's good to know a little bit about you. Uh, you can lower your hands, no problem. And we're going to start with our material, okay? Do you have everything ready with the platform? Um, okay. Jamie Lopez, no problem. Maybe tomorrow. Uh, okay. I'll, um, do all of you have access to the platform already? Anyone has problem with the platform? No? Okay. Well, not yet. not yet, so please try, okay? Let me show you the manual. We're going to start with that tonight. Okay. Good. Uh, the first unit we are going to start with, it's called, it's really worth seeing. It's really worth seeing, okay? So you say that when you want to motivate someone to go to visit uh, any particular place. So you want to encourage someone to go to a, a, a city or a, a park or a particular place in a city, which is what we call landmarks landmarks so let's read a little bit about these famous landmarks okay famous landmarks around the world uh let me read this first okay i'm going to read this text and I will record it in WhatsApp. So you can practice later, you can listen to it later if you want to practice the pronunciation, okay? Later I will ask you to read them and we are going to work with this. Okay, first, famous landmarks. The Great Wall of China was begun in 20, uh, in 214 BC. It is the largest structure ever built. The Colosseum in Rome was opened in 80 AD. 
It was sometimes filled with water for ship butter. The Taj Mahal in India was built between 1630 and 1652. It is a tomb for the wife of an Indian prince. The Statue of Liberty in New York was opened in 1886. It was a gift to Americans from the people of France. The Eiffel Tower in Paris was completed in 1889. It was built for the 100th anniversary of the French Revolution. Okay, there you have the audio in WhatsApp. Now, let me uh, show you a couple of things on each part. I'm going to study later. The Great Wall of China, says here, was begun when he or in 214 BC. The Colosseum in Rome was opened. Oh, they are. It was sometimes filled with water. I'm sorry, I did it to sneak. The Taj Mahal in India was built between 1630 and 1652. Natural liberty in New York was open. We're going to study this. The Eiffel Tower was completed. 1889. It was built for the 100th anniversary. Okay, just keep this doctors this language in mind. So about these places, we have some questions. We have three questions. Four actually. Have you ever seen any of these landmarks? Do you know anyone who has? What else do you know about these places? What are the three most famous landmarks in your country, in El Salvador? Okay. I will give you time to work in groups. I will send you to work in groups. I want you to respond these questions. Okay. Uh, particularly in in this question, what else do you know about these places? I will. I I want you to uh, look for more information about these places. At least one thing more about each place, okay? One piece of information that is not in the text about these places. Not too much, not, not too long. Only one thing more about each place. So in your groups, you are going to do your research about this. And the last one, what are the three most famous landmarks in El Salvador? So you, I want you to name three famous landmarks up to you in your group in El Salvador, okay? Is it clear what you are going to do? You are going to respond the questions. You are going to uh, get a little bit of more information about each place, something that is not in the text. 
something new about each play. And finally, you are going to name three landmarks in El Salvador, three famous landmarks in El Salvador. So working group, I want to send you to working groups. Okay, let's see. I think. Let's see, this is a good. So please join your groups and work. I will give you 10 minutes to work on this question. See you in around 10 minutes. Julissa, Luis, Alex, Sander, Jaime, and Morena, your groups are waiting for you. Luis, Marisa, and Julissa, your groups are waiting for you.
Hi, Julissa. I am sending you to another group. There is only three, three places here in El Salvador. Uh, Surf City. Surf City, uh -huh. El Salvador del Mundo, y El Golf. Cante San Salvador. Joaquin. Hello, teacher. Hello. Uh, we were uh, making different questions in here. Uh, and we have parties. Ah, sorry, I don't remember the paper exactly. Uh, eh, but we were asking and answering all of the questions. That's right. Perfect. And what else can I ask you? Uh, <clears throat> how old are you? <laughs> Me? Yeah. That's a secret. <laughs> You finish the exercise? We... Yeah. Uh, teacher, just one question. We uh -huh. need to search information about each place? Yeah. Okay. Okay. One extra thing. Only one little thing more about it. Okay, okay got it. So let's search <laughs> some extra thing. You can say something about the, the war pit in China. Uh -huh. Hello, people. Did you finish? No, yes. Okay. Keep working. See you. People. People get a marriage. In English, in English, the there Hello, people. Hello. Hello. Ah, pues póngalo en el chat. Yo voy a ponerlo del Taj Mahal. Hey, nice Spanish. Vaya. <laughs> Sorry, teacher. Tu app <laughs> para avanzar. <laughs> Uh, okay, but try to make it to, to do it in English. See, in, in, digamos, se va a terminar. 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 Se Okay, 
Okay. Yes, I was talking about different places here in El Salvador. A cathedral, for example, is, is, is a landmark for us. A, a national theater too. But I was talking about the volcanoes. Okay. Good. Yes. Very good. Okay. See you. And, and, okay. Oh, tell okay. me. Tell, tell me. And we never visit those places because we don't have we we won't have the opportunity. Yes, what but place? I had a those places. All of the, the place, all of the place in the book. Yes. <laughs> ah, yeah, they are <laughs> they are too far. Yes, yes. that's true. Yes. But I had a a next classmate. That uh, visit France, uh, France, ah. Brazil, yeah. and that was a little bit jealous because it looks really cool. But I don't know why. But I don't. I am not really interested in France. But yeah, I was a little bit jealous about it. <laughs> okay. but Hey, that that TV is really loud. <laughs> ah, my father watching TV. I'm so sorry. I'm apologizing for that inconvenience. But my father, you know, ah, he, okay. he's elderly and he couldn't he hear very well. Volume. I'm so yeah. sorry. Yes, I know. Okay. I'm going to leave mute. <laughs> uh, so okay. okay. So think about what which of those landmarks in the book do you would like to visit. Oh, okay. No. No. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, talk about that. Okay. Later. Okay. See ya. It's okay. See, See ya. ya. See ya so. Guys, are you there? Hello? Hello? <laughs> I'm sorry. The power went out here for a minute, several minutes. Okay, no problem. We all are back. <laughs> Okay, people, quickly. Uh, we have we have some questions here. Okay, so has anyone of you has anyone ever visited any of these landmarks? Just to know. Have you been there? No. No? Ah. I wish. Ah, okay. Oh, has anyone visited any of those? No? I surely not. Not yet. Not yet? What about you, Gladys? Well, I I met uh, the Statue of the Liberty. Oh, okay. Twenty years ago. Ah. And it's very nice the trip because people have to get a ship uh -huh. to across uh fifteen minutes on the sea, and then we got to the Statue of the Liberty. Okay. And then we have to come back on the same ship. To Manhattan. Oh, nice. Very nice. Anyone else? No. Okay. If not, so which one would you like to visit? 
write write in the chat. Okay, let's do it quickly in the chat. Everybody, which of these landmarks you would like to visit? Write in the chat. I would like to go to the Eiffel Tower. I would like to go to the Taj Mahal. Write in the chat. The Eiffel Tower, says Jamie. What about the rest? Come on, right. I would like to, oh, Floor wants to go to all of them. Uh, the Eiffel Tower, Gladys also. Come on, people, right, right in the chat. Which one you would like to visit? Go to Rome, Osvaldo, the Statue of Liberty, Statue of Liberty. Uh, I would like to go to Taj Mahal, says Julissa. Come on, people, quickly, quickly, ready to chat. I Which... would like to visit Torre Bell. The Eiffel Tower? Jamie, Kyoto. Kyoto is not in the book, but okay, that's fine. Uh, Marina says the Statue of Liberty, the Eiffel Tower. Tower. Be careful. Towel is something different. Towel is what you use to get dry after the shower. <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. What else? The Colosseum in Rome. There's Ernesto. Hey, Grecia, you have a lot of a lot of tickets here to sell. Where is Grecia? Where is Grecia? She's not here anymore. Oh, come on. Who was the other agent? Who was the other travel agent? I don't remember who was the other one. The Temple of Kyoto, okay. The Great Wall of China or the Statue of Liberty, says Marcelo. The Statue of Unity. Is another one? Is that another one, Marcelo? The Statue of Unity. Elizabeth says the Great Wall. Oh, really? Which one is that, Marcelo? Where is it? I have never heard about that. Yeah, okay, I'm sorry, Grecia. Okay, very good. So I hope you did your research about, oh, but it's time. Oh, okay, we're going to continue tomorrow with the, with the extra information you, you found about these places. If you didn't find anything, you have time. Because tomorrow you will tell us a little bit more about of these places. Okay, something extra that is okay. not mentioned there. But quickly, write in the chat. The, oh, I think it's time. We have to stop because somebody else uses the same account for class at nine. So no worries. We'll continue tomorrow. Okay. Have a good night, people. See you tomorrow. Good night, teacher. Good night, good night good teacher. Good nice to meet night. you. Good night, tomorrow. teacher. See you tomorrow. Bye. See you guys. I see you tomorrow, bye -bye. teacher. I see you tomorrow. Tomorrow.